Yo, what is up guys? It is Weaver Bracken Leonard Banger Videos. Today we are showing off my uh, newest creation. Hey, don't hate me if this deck is everywhere on ladder in a few days. But we are running a Giant Skeleton Guards Goblin Giant deck. Um, if you guys don't know, I made a Goblin Giant deck with Magnite a couple seasons ago. And now we're trying it with Giant Skeleton. So far, it's been doing really good on ladder. I'll show you some of my past games. You know, we're just we're kind of destroying every opponent. So it's going to do a couple of live games right now. It's early season, but the balance changes have hit, and it's been pretty crazy, not going to lie. Let me turn my light on real quick. There we go. But yeah, I want to thank you guys once again for all the new subs recently. It's been actually crazy. Let me just move my webcam a bit as well. There we go. I want to thank everybody for the subs recently. You guys have been crazy supportive. We hit 7,000 subscribers. Which is an amazing milestone for me. Um, hopefully we can hit 10k this year, and even more. Hopefully, you know, invest in sweep coins. Stocks going through the roof right now. Crazy experience. But yeah, so now we first we first more in first game. Okay, you know what's funny? I faced more in first time in my last video as well. So we're just gonna cycle bats here. Um, he's running the cannoneer troop, so it's actually a really good matchup for him. Uh, because of yeah, he's got he's got cannoneer, and yeah. They both talk. Okay, so it's a, it's an Arch Queen deck, which I'm kind of okay with, to be honest. And we're gonna see what he's rocking with here. Arch Queen's actually super broken right now. If you guys haven't tried out Arch Queen, I'd really recommend trying it out because it is so strong. Like, is that does that even make it the tower? Oh, I, I think one makes the tower. Yeah, let's go. So he's gonna pop ability. Makes sense. Um, I don't know what he's running. I think it's RG. But it could be X Hog. Nah, I'm confused. What is he running here? That bomb's gonna do a lot. Mortar. Okay. So we're just gonna spell this, and it's this is an interesting matchup we got going on. So we're just gonna spell this right now. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Candor does really good against uh, my two troops, so you always kind of want to run a building in these kind of uh, matchups. Yeah. Like, he has to play his uh, thing there. So, yeah. Bats are actually really good in case your opponent's running Cannoneer. Obviously. And we're going to go uh, here with this. I can actually go guards here as well. Um, just because, like, he uses Log, right? But yeah, his Cannoneer is actually going to kind of do a little bit of work versus mine. And Ice Spear comes down as well. Oof. 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 Oof, yo, Cannon is so bad against Swarm. Oh my god. Even just looking at that, you're like, what? No, that's crazy, eh? We're just gonna go Cannon. Jump up in the back here. Uh, it's okay. He goes there at the bridge. I'm okay with this. Just gonna play that here. Fireball both these. I think we go Bats here. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Interesting plays by my opponent. Uh, we could just go Giant Skeleton here. He's going to try to break through the Mortar, though. That's probably his best bet. Um, he's got Ice Spirit, which is good. Honestly, any deck that kind of has, like, Freeze Troops is going to be really good with, uh, obviously, you know. Oh, he has Evo Mortar. I did not know that. My bad. Is that both? I think it does. I think it does hit both. Alright, we could go uh, that for this. Alright. I think I may have messed up here. I think I may have messed up. I should be going in when he goes mortar. That's my mistake. Uh, Arch Queen's really strong though. We're going to go hard in the back now because, yeah, he did use his uh, mortar. Uh, should be playing this opposite lane though. I don't know why I'm not. Yeah, it's all good. He's going to go like knight on top of it. He doesn't go knight. He's go here with this. Should rage all these. And uh, hopefully this might actually break through, which is going to be kind of funny if it does. Uh, e e well, we do have a game going on of Clash Royale, that's all I know. Alright, we're going to kite this opposite lane here. We're going to go here with this. Okay. Get these down. Arch Queen and the bats and... Everything. Uh, I think we get a little bit of damage. Not enough to, like, you know, make it round worthy, though. So we're going to play this. Then go for our hunter. And if he wants to play more troops, we could uh, 
protect it a bit more here with just like yeah guards he goes log that's fine like I said he's really trying to break through with uh, you know, these kind of troops here but we should be fine kind of breaking in with all these I want to go here and try and get a uh, decent push here if you uh, yeah it's it's really good on defense though that's the only problem we got with this card is yeah it's pretty good on defense I'm actually going to try to get some uh, tower damage here. Even if we catch this thing, which we don't. It's uh, not going to do much. We got to try to break through here with everything. I don't know why it's locked onto that. And that makes it to my tower, unfortunately. That yeah, cannon here just does really good against Swarm. Uh, Beatdown. Uh, even though I had, like, he has Ice Spirit for my bats it's just when you have decks that have a lot of cycle cards that's where cannoneer gets really good um and poison for graveyard stuff like that you gotta think about stuff like that um i could have played it better though should have went more opposite lane though and uh yeah i think i let too much damage come to my towers there and yeah that second time we face cannoneer with a beatdown deck i want to try to face cannoneer with a cycle deck like with uh just a bunch of swarm cards and see what happens and you know but unfortunately, you know, we face Morton, who's running a different deck that I'm not used to. New meta, new season, and I'm running two six elixir tanks. So it's actually like a perfect matchup for him. But yeah, if that if that was like Princess Towers, I'm pretty sure I break through there. But it's a lot of new interactions you gotta learn. So reverse Caesar with actual Princess Towers. So let's go. We're gonna go uh, fisherman here. Please don't have a giant skeleton, because that is gonna be a giant skeleton bomb on my tower. And yeah, we're we're uh, we're not trying to have that happen, eh, boys? Okay. So it's looking like it's not that. This guy's running hog, which is, uh, you know, everyone runs hog, right? <laughs> everyone runs hog. So we're going to pull that in. Okay, it's fine with me. Can we actually kind of probably just go here with this? Nah, he keeps this alive. I hate firecracker so much, boys. This is why I want to run, like, uh, whatchamacallit. Is he, is he running evil firecracker, too? Oh, that's annoying. Pull that in. Okay, I think I could, I could go here with Goblin Giant and potentially Bats. Uh, bats Evil aren't great. There's like some matchups where they work and there's some matchups where they just don't. It is Evil Firecracker, okay, that's pretty annoying. It's gonna rage us all and uh, yeah, get back to this. There we go. Probably plays Hog here, so I probably just play Hunter Low and surround his uh, thingy. That's what I would do. That's what most of these players would do, to be honest. They're super aggressive with their hogs. So yeah, we just deal with that. We have we have fireball for his next firecracker though, which is really good. He's probably gonna play at the bridge, so uh yeah, let's go a little low here. The hunter. Gets one hit, but like I said, if he goes firecracker, he's gonna get some chip damage. But like I said, I'm fine with that. I just wanna kill it. <laughs> I just wanna kill it. Get it off the board. I hate that card. Evil firecracker is so annoying. Ring evil firecracker is crazy over Evil Knight too, by the way. Just saying. Thoughts on him going like you fire at the bridge? Nah. That'd be too crazy, yeah. I don't think that's a good play though. Cause I actually just go uh, like Evo Bats here. Go Goblin Giant with like these troops and I should actually break through here, which is like uh, kinda crazy. Even with all these troops, yeah, like that's just actually game, unfortunately for him. He did not expect that to uh, do this much damage, which is fair. But yo, Evil Firecracker is actually saving him. Nah, there's no way you actually get saved by this, right? There's no shot. Wow, he got saved by that, by the way. I, I thought we actually did the game winning push. Guess not. Okay, he's one away from Evil Firecracker. So we're just going to go Goblin Giant this lane and uh, see what happens. So I'm just gonna keep this alive for the longest time possible. Super annoying. But I think we just go, yeah, we go Hunter pretty high here. Go Firecracker, Bats. And yeah, that's a that's an easy, uh, get that out of this field. This instant. We go in here. He goes in there too. Another interesting play by my boy. He's cooking, that's for sure. 
I'm just gonna, yeah, get that pulling. Get over here. Come on, destroy it. Nah. Nah. Ain't no way, huh? Ain't no way. Alright, you just gave us huge fireball value here, though. Unfortunately for you, my boy. Yeah, GG. Like, that fireball value, he just had to play his firecracker to the right, and we win. And he, like, he should win there. But that just is deck. Like, evil bats are kind of nasty if they don't have a response to it. But Cannoneer obviously one-shots them. So it's not as good. But yeah, nice. Good job for us. Sort of claiming these rewards. It's super loud. <laughs> but uh, so far, one loss. But it's two cannon in your deck. You're not going to face those a lot. You're not going to face those a lot. And the other one is versus uh, a normal Princess Tower, which we won. So good job for us. Give us a round of applause. And yeah, guys, hey, if you're new here, hope you guys are enjoying the content. Drop a like. Drop a subscribe. If you guys are not subscribed, like I said, sweep coin to the moon, baby. Uh, let's run a few more games. I'm going to cut to it right now. All right, so versus Aerosmith here. I, I faced this guy so many times, but I just cannot remember what runs. So he's got evil skeletons. I'm gonna split guards here. Another princess tower. It looks like it's got Diglett. You know, guys, another Pokemon. Um, I'm thinking it's 2.6. I'm not thinking it's 2.6 anymore. Oh, it's Drill. Yeah. Okay, I remember this guy. Okay, this, this, this is gonna be an interesting matchup that we got. So yeah, we got we got this going on here. Just gonna get all that pulled. Yeah. See, I don't know why you go in there, though. Like, low-key, that does not seem like a good place. So he's got evil skeletons now. Um, so I'm actually going to go Goblinite in the back here. And if he wants to, like, like hit Obsolene again, I uh, I got a pretty good defense. So he needs two more troops to get back to uh, Inferno Tower, which is actually wild. He's already back to it. Um, this is a very defensive control deck, though, if you guys are uh, curious about that. So I'm just going to go, like, Hunter at the bridge here. And, like, I feel like this guy's going to give me somewhat value. Don't go in here. We just go giant skeleton here. We're up elixir still. He overcommitted. He has evil skeletons. So that's what we got to be worried about. We have guards for his, uh, I think he's, he's log fireball. Inferno Tower here again, though, All right? He should. Nah, okay, I'm fine with that, too. There's Fireball there. Fine with that. We just gotta survive single. If we survive single, we're chilling. Uh, probably go Hunter in the back here. He might go ban at the bridge. I'm expecting a ban at the bridge. Then we should just go uh, Giant Skeleton low, let it dash, then go Goblin Giant obviously. We got Evo Bats now, but don't want those to get killed with the Fire Spirit. That's an annoying card, man. Don't like facing that. Alright, let's see what we can cook here. We're just gonna go Fisherman here. Let's see what he wants to do. Okay, then we go Goblin Giant in the right lane, and we should win here. No, no, Skeleton, stop. Stop, please. I beg. I could have kept... Oh, I should have kept going in there, because that was a horrible fireball by him. Oh man. Sucks when they make a really bad play like that, eh? And you can't really punish it. We'll try though. We'll try our best. Has so much health though, eh? Only problem with all this. We could uh get that going. Dash into the bomb? Yeah. <laughs> That's kinda like the main idea of push you want. Hunter's having a bit of an aneurysm, doesn't want to shoot. We actually just kinda go like this. Bring that in. Actually, go in here. There we go. That should be game, actually, though. Like, he's got nothing. That was a horrible push by him. Let's go. 
GG. The control deck breaks through Infernal Towers somehow. But yeah, you, got, you guys have so much defensive troops, and the offense is actually super annoying to defend. Like, you're, you're looking at a huge counter push there. All right, let's go for one more game. We are currently 28th. Um, I think we, if we win this game, we get 2K, which would be nice. And hey, so far, we've only lost to Morin, a great player. Arvis, oh, oh, this guy's annoying. This might be a loss. <laughs> Straight up, this this is this is that recruits deck. Yo, this deck toxic as shit. All right, we're gonna get bats and uh, fish him down here. And he runs firecracker too, which is to make it even more annoying. Like this man's got straight, straight cancer deck. Like, it's actually so annoying. Um, I guess we just go guards here. Go hunter. Yeah, like he, he's got mighty miner too. Like, oh. It's it is a deck of all time. Let's just say that. Doesn't work. Hit it. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Pretty sure I'm gonna go bats here. Just to maybe force out an ability if he wants to. Yeah, force out his arrows there is actually really good for us. That's a crazy play. Just survive single. That's all I want to do is survive single here. Oh, it's not looking good though. It is not looking good, my boy. Yeah, it's just... It's a great game. It's a fireball. Alright, minute 20 left. Like I said, we're just surviving. I'm not... Bra There's no shot I break through in... Um, whatchamacallit though. That, that, that's just what you guys gotta remember. There is no way I break through in uh, what should we call it? So yeah, we're, we're like we're taking damage here because we're obviously running forty spells with all of his bait cards. But uh, I think we're doing good. I think we're doing, that actually might pull it in. Yeah, that's that's a crazy misplay by him. He's got heroes anyways. Let's fireball this. We could bat that if we pop it early enough, we won't get any hits. And some will come up forward. I'm okay with. He goes recruits at the bridge here. Paper is. So that's coming. There is. There is. I'm fine with that as well. Everything's looking okay, to be honest. Just rage here. You actually kind of actually just pull this in. And maybe go bats here. And yeah, we should be fine. Not using my spell on defense. I don't know why I didn't. That's a really bad play by me. I'm kind of hoping I could break through here. Because that's a really bad play by him as well. Maybe do something here. I hate on. I hate. I hate that card so much. I hate it so much. I hate it so much. Does anyone else hate this card? so much 
Yo, if it was Dark Goblin, we just win, by the way. If it was Dark Goblin, we just win. But the fact that he just has Firecracker and just so much Swarm is just... And Arrows. Like, even Fireball, I win as well. Yeah, like, this guy is not going to finish high at all. Like, it just... Yeah, probably should rage on defense there. But, uh... Like, what can I do? What can I do? Like, I, I knew from the start of the matchup, like, that, that Firecracker is going to just be a pain in my ass. A pain in my ass that whole time. All right, well, we'll get one more win or loss, but so far, what's the game? It's We're up we're up two, down two, I think, right? Yeah, up two, down two. Uh, let's break. Let's go, let's go into the positives there. We're at a 50% win rate. Um, <laughs> every deck has bad matchups, okay? You're not going to be facing recruits full bait spam. And if you are, if it's Fireball, that's the thing. Two changes in cards there. If it's, if it's not arrows, I win. If it's Fireball, I win. But it's just, it's that one specific version that's like, yo, like, come on, bro. Like, where did he finish last season? I'm, a tier, I'm an A1 hater. I'm an A1 hater. Bro, finished 410. Yeah, he plays like a 410 player. All right, so versus Nate for the last game. I wonder what Nate is cooking. Like I said, win or lose, we're throwing this game in. Um, I had one last game that I said I was going to throw in, but it was actually, I just, uh, I tilted. I tilted. I, I, couldn't, I couldn't take it anymore. I was losing my mind. So Nate's not running the new tower troop either. So out of the five games we well, six games. Technically, we faced only one, uh, one cannoneer, which is interesting. You know, uh, I want to hear your guys' thoughts on that. Wait, what do, what do you think they should do to cannoneer? I see people saying they should remove it, which I think is actually pretty funny. Um, but uh, like, I kind of agree, Loki. I kind of agree, Kai Key actually. No, hit it. Nah, that's unlucky. All right, that's war. probably going to be our only damage we get all game, or probably going to have to spell cycle him, <laughs> which is going to be funny. But, yeah. The, the, I think it was going to my tower, eh? One, two, three, four. No. Okay. I thought the last guard would take a couple more hits, though. So, we're going to go Dranskill in the back here. So, over is Baby Nay. He's a fellow YouTuber. Same with Morn. So, we faced two YouTubers already. Wild. Well, I think they're streaming. I think they are streaming. Mm, did he log? I don't think so. We go uh, Fisherman here. Then he's gonna log. Yo, Nate's actually like a really bad player. Cause he has to rely on uh delivery for defenses, which is kinda funny. You know else notice that? About Nate. Bro loves his delivery for defenses. I don't know why. Like chill out little bro. You know? We go and get some damage here, cause you know I'm just the king. And there you go, just a little little delivery. Then you just go bats here. He's probably gonna go in. So he thinks I gotta spend a lot to defend that, but I actually don't. So yeah, let's go fisherman here. Told you, I knew exactly what he's gonna do. These players are actually robots, man. No brain. Gonna check the king. Wait, no, it's all good. We should go Jansko in the back here. We could probably do a, uh, I don't know, that's a play you just did, my boy. Yeah, let's, let's that, that unstoppable poison damage, right? Yeah, yippee, so cool, so fun. Love it, love it. Love it, you really are the uh, high skill player everyone talks about, right? Yeah, how's that, buddy? You like that? Barely any damage. With a whole ass push too, by the way. There you go. Same push again. I break through. I go back to the bridge. And we should win the game here. Because bats at the bridge are actually kind of nasty. <laughs> They're actually hella nasty. Unless he has, like, delivery. But even, like, poison should not take those down. Yeah, nice. There you go. Saving the bats from the really matter. He might go in here. Try to get this chip damage. But if he don't, then we just win again. And, yeah. Just keep rinsing and repeating. Um, I might start just fireball cycling his tower, to be honest. I guess it's about, like, a couple fireballs in. Thoughts on that? Like, we just fireball both of these. And then, like, what happens? You know? Like, see? Like, what really happens here? Like, does he actually defend with delivery? Because delivery is a bailout card. Nah, he don't. He don't. We break through. Yo, Nate. Yo, Nate. Hold this L, baby. 
Hold this L, baby Nate. It's your name to be called Baby L. Oh, when you hold this L. Whoa, 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 whoa. But yeah. GG. GG. We played better. We played better. Uh, versus the guy who could always get damage on your tower. And yeah, guys. Try this deck out. I'll show you the deck I lost to. I just... Hey, I could have won that easily. That's why I was pissed off. Because, like, to be honest, I should be winning that. But yeah, guys. If you joined in the video, drop a like. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Invest in Sweepcoin. To the moon, baby. I'll see you guys in the banger video. Peace out.